way back in high school, many, many years ago, um, I did something called forensics, which is a, it was a voice competition. And we did, well, I, I focused on poetry and prose reading. Um, there were people, people who did extemporaneous speaking and wrote speeches and did stuff on the, on the fly. I like to kind of get it going and rehearse and stuff. Um, I like a script. <laughs> and so I did poetry and prose readings um, and I ended up being Virginia State champion in my senior year of high school. Um, but at that point, that kind of, that was a bit of voice acting because you had to, it was um, dramatic oral interpretation of a, of a piece of, of literature. Even then, the, some of the judges were saying, you, you've got a career in this. And I kind of went, in like talking? <laughs> Many years down the road, all of a sudden I have a career in talking. Um, but really the anime stuff was after I got out of grad school. Um, so about 96, uh, graduated in 95, so 96 I was doing a, a show. And uh, the, my, my female lead in it, my co-lead, um, was Dorothy Fawn, who you may know uh, and people know. And she said, hey, I'm doing this thing and I think you'd be good at it. And she brought me up and introduced me to the studio and and went and exploded after that. A lot of times we do get a bio or at least a picture. Sometimes it's just a little black and white animatic drawing kind of thing. Um, there's not much to go on. Uh, the, oftentimes the director will give us a lot of information, which is good if they can. I, I like to work visually. So I like to see what the thing looks like. Okay, that's what it looks like. And then I'll start throwing out sounds and you know, is it long and tall? Is it short and wide? Um, is it an older character, younger character? So they just start kind of molding the clay of your voice to get there. I think one of the weirdest and most fun examples of that that I have was from World of Warcraft uh, early in my career, where I was doing a gig for them. And they went, hey, you know, look at this other character with, you know, you might want to try. Um, and just kind of audition for it on the spot, so I'm sitting there, oh, okay. And they go, well, okay, this is a troll, and it is an eagle avatar troll. I'm like, okay, eagle avatar, it's a troll. So what does a troll sound like? Oh, and it's, an, it's an eagle. And then they threw in, oh, by the way, in World of Warcraft, trolls have Jamaican accents. Uh, so I'm like, okay, uh, so a troll, and then it's an eagle, and they would have, feed me, brothers, came out, and they went, Good, let's go. <laughs> and I just recorded that in my character. There's a lot more people involved. Um, it's in many ways easier to get into, but more competitive because there's a lot of people, but there's a lot more voiceover. There's much more, anime is very popular. Video games are incredibly popular. So there's a lot of work out there. When I started, just as we were getting out of tape, I guess, and into the digital stuff, but even then, it was still difficult, and 20 loops an hour was pretty good. Now it's like 40, 50, because with Pro Tools and the software, they can massage it, make it shorter, longer, edit it in such a way that you can match, match the mouth flaps, sync, um, much easier. But we had to, back then, you had to hit it, because if you couldn't hit your 20, 25 loops an hour, you didn't get hired back again. <laughs> it's interesting I mean, because we do this work we're usually well on a film set you're with a bunch of people but especially the anime and the games and things you're all in the little booth by yourself or with the director maybe with an ensemble record um but yeah when you get out there and meet people who it has affected and who may have watched it in school or or gotten them through sometimes rough times at home um it's a very different feeling it's it's uh it's, it's like a weird responsibility and yet um it's a real connection to the fans. And it's 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 very gratifying in, in many ways. And it's kind of like, you know, we're doing good work. It's not just kind of play characters and, and having fun voicing cartoons. What would you like to know? Comment below. <laughs>